Student Services, Cashier's Office. The Cashier's Office is where students go to make a payment to CSN for course fees, to get a refund for course fees, to get a fee assessment, and to pick up documentation. An ID is required. Questions about financial aid must go through the financial aid office, not through the cashier's office. It is very important for students to monitor the CSN website for the latest information about refunds, just in case a student needs to drop a course or withdraw a course. Students may be entitled to a full refund or a partial refund of the original payment of the course. It all depends on the length of the course, like 16, 8, or 4 weeks, and it depends on the time when students withdraw. There are so many rules, so it's important for students to understand those rules for the semester they are in and always refer to the CSN website for the most up-to-date information. Current students should check My Coyote Plan first. Otherwise, search Cashier on the CSN website, especially the Frequently Asked Questions section. Let me show you. If you go to csn.edu and you click on Search, type in Cashier, press Search, and CSN Cashier's Office should come up. Then you get to the cashier's office page and it explains what the cashier's office does and then it gives all of these clickable buttons here and it changes the information. So the first one is important information about course fees. And notice there are all kinds of links for students to click on. So be sure to click on all of those links to learn more about it. The second one is payment and scholarship information. Again, there's so much more to read here. Make sure that you have someone to help you understand all of these important paragraphs. Predictable pricing. This gives an overview of how much students should expect to pay, depending on what type of student they are. Full-time, part-time, resident, non-resident, etc. Plus course fees for distance education. Here is the student refund section, and it explains exactly the percentage amount students should expect depending on the full term or short term or long term course they are in and then when they withdraw. And then at the bottom there are lots of frequently asked questions like do I need to sign in the Coyote queue for the cashier's office? Press the arrow and the answer will be here all kinds of questions here. So be sure to check it out. The cashier's office is one of the most important offices on the CSN campus. If you don't make your payment, you won't have a class to attend. So be sure to get that taken care of early and good luck.